to the internet. <laughs> Just wait until the grandmas and grandpas log on to the internet. Then 50% of the internet will be pornography. <laughs> And before I begin today, giving you a guided tour of the future, let me tell you a cautionary story. A cautionary story about what happened over 200 years ago. We had the great French Revolution. And one day there were three gentlemen about to have their heads chopped off at the guillotine. There was a priest, a lawyer, and a theoretical physicist, just like me, about to have our heads chopped off. Well, they put the priest's head on the chopping block, and they asked him, do you have any last words? And the priest said, yes, yes. He said, God, God from above shall certainly set me free. Well, all eyes were on the blade. They raised the blade. The blade came down, swish, and stopped right before it hit the neck of the priest. <gasps> the crowd gasped. They had never seen this before. And so the crowd chanted, let the priest go. And now let's see about the lawyer. Yes. <laughs> they put the lawyer's head on the chopping block. And they asked him, do you have any last words? And he said, yes. Maybe the spirit of justice. Yes, justice <laughs> shall set me free. All eyes were on the blade. They raised the blade. The blade came down, swish, and stopped right before it hit the neck of the lawyer. Well, this time the crowd went crazy. <coughs> the crowd said, let the priest go. Let the lawyer go. God has spoken today. And now let's see about the physicist. <laughs> well, they put the physicist's head in the chopping block. And they asked him, do you last, have any last words? And he said, yeah. Yeah, I got some last words. And he said, you know, I don't know too much about God, and I know even less about the law. But I do know one thing. If you look up, you'll see that the rope is stuck on the pulley. 